I've always fancied myself an artist. I could call myself the artist formerly known as Prince. One will never be royal. <laughs> George and Charlotte are just like any other little boy and girl, always hiding the keys to their nanny's Bentley and eating far too much caviar. This mask rules! Well, naturally, I assumed that the Prince of Wales would be an actual whale. Look, Philip, I'm a stamp. Yes, I, yes, I, I do love myself some queen. Bohemian Rhapsody is a hell of a jam. I'm going to be a mighty king, so enemies beware. Well, I've never seen a king or beast with quite so little hair. Do it for Queen and Corgi. Yes, George is a real little prince. He loves his raspberry beret, and he very much dislikes it when doves cry. Dressing up in costumes or running around naked. As a child? No, what? No, not as a child. This was last week. Sixty-three years on the throne. Yes, it was one hell of a curry. <laughs> I sometimes wonder if I'll ever be king. How do you think I feel? I've been the proverbial sodding bridesmaid for the last sixty years. One once played cards in the throne room and ended with a royal flush. Yes, of course I know people make horse jokes about me. Do I care? Nay. I could never be the king. Nobody can replace Elvis. Catherine, let's pretend to be commoners. I'll call you Kathy, and you call me Willie. I pulled up to the castle around seven or eight and I yelled to the chauffeur, you're home, thank you ever so much. I looked at my kingdom, I was finally there to sit on my throne as the Prince of Balmoral. Oh, Philip, the commoners are revolting. Well, I'm, I'm not sure I'd go quite that far, but some of them are pretty hard to stomach. When I become king, I'll consider it my crowning achievement. If I was two-faced, would I be wearing this one? I can't find my ruler. That Lord girl is correct. She will never be royal. Look, Philip, I'm a coin. 